my name is Jonathan Wiley and in this video I'm going to give you a quick overview of two new features for the iPad in iOS 9. One is called Split View and one is called Slide Over. As you can see from the slide, not all of these features are available for all iPads. So make sure that you have a compatible iPad before trying to engage one of these features. Right now I'm inside Safari and I'm going to start by demonstrating the slide over view and that is activated by taking a finger and putting it on the right hand bezel of your iPad. Sliding it in from right to left will bring in one of the last apps that you were using. So right now you're looking at my Twitter feed and I can quickly check and see what the latest tweets are in my feed. However, you're not limited to just the Twitter app. At the top of the screen on the sidebar here, you can pull down with one finger and here you can come and choose a variety of different apps that are compatible with Slide Over. Here's the Notes app. So if I wanted to take a quick note or I wanted to write a quick email or I wanted to check on my calendar, I can pull these into the Slide Over view and do that from there. Split View is something different. It takes Slide Over to the next level. So when you slide in from the right hand side here, you will see a small bar halfway down the side of that slide over app. If you take that bar and you pull it over towards the middle, you can see what happens. You have two apps side by side on your screen. You can adjust the division of the apps here by sliding that middle bar to one side and get a two thirds, one third split. So the difference between slide over and split view is that in split view, both apps can be used at the same time. So I can browse up and down through here on a website and take notes on the other side at the same time. In slide over, you can only use the app that you slide over. So that's a quick look at slide over and split view for the iPad. I hope you find it useful.